Hi everyone, Dave here at Byerly RV in Eureka, Missouri. Today, we're gonna to take a look at a brand new 2021 Van Lee Beacon Model 39 FBB behind me. But first, I wanna say thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already done so, take a second to subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook. You'll be able to keep up with the latest news and videos such as new product videos like this one. Now, back to the Beacon 39 FBB. We're gonna start on the outside and talk a little bit about the outside first. There's so many great places or great features on this. I don't know where to start almost. And then we'll hide in and we'll look at some of that as well. Um, right up front, this vehicle was ordered with the gen prep. So next to the, there's a spot for two batteries. And then this is the gen prep here, guys. So we've got a spot for a generator, if you would like. Above that, when you do gen prep, you get the um, automatic transfer switch as well. And on the inside, we've got the start stop switch and the hour meter to control the generator. So pretty much everything's here. Beautiful front cap uh, where you can see the Van Lee, a division of Tiffin Motorhomes. Okay, for those of you that don't know, Tiffin Motorhomes is the number one manufacturer of diesel pusher motorhomes in the United States. And this is the towable division, essentially. Um, Van Lee is a division of Tiffin Motorhomes and uh, started by Van and Lee Tiffin, uh, Bob Tiffin's son and grandson. Anyway, um, beautiful stuff here, you guys, and you'll see that as we go through, uh, just of the highest quality here. Um, this is our top of the line fifth wheel. Uh, we've also got a Rotaflex pin box. It's got a little dampener in here and a pivoting head. Helps with the chucking and things like that. It's a heavy vehicle, guys. 14.7 uh, empty is about what we weigh here, um, right at about 40 feet long-ish. We've got our uh, controls for automatic leveling right here. Six point auto level, just like you would expect. Um, we head down the side here, we've got LP uh, tanks on both sides. Uh, a uh, humongous storage compartment here, which opens up to the other side. We'll take another look when we go around the other side at some of the things in there. But um, I do have an additional panel, control panel right here uh, for some of my outside stuff, including my jacks and things like that. This little uh, compartment here is very nice. This is, okay, so one thing about um, the uh, Van Lee product, this product is built in Corinth, Mississippi. Okay, it's not built in Indiana. And uh, they make as much of this product themselves as they can. And what I mean by that, you can see that right here, this metal, they cut this, they have this laser cutter that cuts and labels all this stuff and everything. So they created this compartment. Um, and when you do this and things like when they build your own doors and you do your own stuff, it just it gives you much more quality control and freedom to do things. This is a beautiful setup here. We've got our whole house water filtration system. We've got our tank flush out, our city water connection. All of our uh, th things that we need for winterizing is easily accessible right here. This has solenoid actuated dump valves okay so this is like when you hit this switch it's not just like a it's not like a, uh, uh, it's a bang bang i mean open close solenoid activated very very awesome i've got low point drains in here hot and cold running water i've even got my ice maker winterizing on off right there which is really convenient to get to very 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 nice um now let's head back around the other side uh as we walk on, so this right here, we oh this just to point this out, this is we did get this with the uh, Truma on-demand water heater. So that's long showers, as long as you want to take in this thing, as long as you have the water, uh, lots of water capacity. If you're not hooked up, but most of the time when you're hooked up, if you're hooked up to a full hookup system and you have an on-demand water heater, oh my goodness, it is just awesome. Uh, so we are this. This is the NASA paint scheme, you guys. It is absolutely. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, this thing came, it's better than I expected. Um, just looks absolutely, it's a black, gray, silver uh, uh, pattern here. Just absolutely beautiful, full paint. You gotta see it in person to really appreciate it. Um, the storage compartment, the other side here, they make it a little bigger on this side. We've got things like a battery shutoff switch in here. We've got a spot for our Dirt Devil uh, Central Vac. Um, and there's an inverter in there as well. You'll see when we go inside, we've got a really nice residential refrigerator and stuff. Uh, I wanna point out before we go inside, this has an awning package on it, the 39 FBB floor plan with this big slide out right here. We get an awning here on the outside of the slide out in addition to the awning that covers the door and all the way to the front. So two awnings on this side and we also got this vehicle. This vehicle has the factory installed slide topper. So you do see some options on this particular vehicle here uh, that you can choose if you wanted to go ahead and order your own. Um, let's head on up into the inside. We've got the solid steps, of course. Uh, this right here, you know, as you walk in, 
this is just awesome. We've got this control panel here that controls essentially the entire camper from right here. I can turn my lights on and off. This is my main home screen. I can see my climate control easily. I can see my tank dumps. But as you go through these tabs, we've got a lighting. We can, everything with the little arrows on it, these are all dimmable lights. We've got three different climate control zones with three air conditioners, three heat pumps, you guys. Uh, just absolute top of the line. My slide out room controls. I, you know, the fans, all of my fans on and off, as well as the lids for those. The ceiling fan is a residential ceiling fan that we'll see. And then we've got settings and things like that. But um, this thing, this is just awesome. This is this part of um, when I talk about things like modern floor plans, when you're in a high end top of the line unit like this, that is what I'm talking about right there. Same thing that's in the motorhomes and all that. Um, I know I keep comparing it to the motorhomes, but Tiffin makes the best motorhomes on the planet. So it's just, you know, it makes sense that that same quality you would expect in here. If you're going to buy a top of the line fifth wheel, you want to get it from the people that know what they're doing. Um, the uh, roof line on this goes straight back. So I've got things like eight foot tall slide outs, which is wonderful. Beautiful window treatments all the way around. Guys, this is literally maybe the best table in the business. And I'm not kidding. There is no legs underneath this thing and it just it's rock solid it is absolutely amazing another thing that you really need to see in person um, from the van lee product their table is as good as it gets the interior color palette is river rock with the sterling cabinetry and we have the chocolate franklin luxury furniture i mentioned that because you know if you've seen any of the other videos i talk about in the higher end stuff you've got residential furniture there are certain campers out there that it's it's camper furniture right so it's meant to be used you know uh, weekends and a few weeks a year and then there are campers that are meant to be lived in and this has you know when you buy a, a couch or a uh, theater seating for your house they figure you're going to use it every single day and that is the same type of thing that you have in here and as a matter of fact the van lee product is warranted for residential occupation guys check the fine print many 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 campers are not actually warranted for residential occupation but the Van Lee product is. Uh, the sofa, again, residential. It's huge, it's long. You can actually lay on this and see the TV. The TV actually rises up on a motor out from behind the fireplace and entertainment center. It's an LG TV, Furion Entertainment Center with DVD players. So many of these entertainment centers nowadays are just these little bitty things. And if you wanted to use a DVD player, you have to bring your own. This has a built-in DVD player. And then below that is the fireplace, right? Built-in electric space heater, big, beautiful fireplace. All that is right across from my theater seating and I can lay on my couch to watch it as well. Um, the kitchen, oh my gosh, island kitchen. You know, one thing that separates the beacon uh, from the other Van Lee products, uh, for example, is things like the countertop beveling here. Uh, beautiful solid service counter with a little bit more detail. That's what you get in the beacon line from Van Lee. We've got all, everything's wood, guys. Everything in here is real. There is no wrap product at all. This is all real stuff. Um, if you've seen any of our other videos, and if you haven't, please take a look at our YouTube channel and check them out. Um, I have a thing about stoves. We've got these great new stoves in the business. Well, this, my friends, may be the best one ever. Uh, this is absolutely incredible. We've got four burners. This is like the biggest oven ever in a camper, I think, ever that I've ever seen. Um, just a big, beautiful insignia, obviously. The name brand stuff, Furion residential size convection microwave so everything in this is bigger everything is residential everything is uh oh i just noticed the sink is actually an undermount stainless like a farmer's sink or whatever this is this is really kind of cool um tons of stories this look at this drawer wow this is huge not only is it huge but they actually finished off the wood in here you guys this is just super cool i've got outlets here outlets here there's outlets all over the place this window this is awesome you guys i mean how often do we see a galley window that's this tiny little thing this is a tiffin thing right here you'll see it in the motorhomes you'll see it in the van lee products uh, great great little addition to their whole lineup you know the fridge is incredible this is an lg thin q i don't even know what all this refrigerator does it's like so cool um this is great too. So when we get upstairs, you're going to see the main bathroom is absolutely incredible. But here we've got a nice little half bath downstairs for everybody else to use so they don't have to go up and go into your living area. Uh, extra storage. You can never have too much storage, right, you guys? Nice soft clothes stuff here. Uh, very, very nice. Um, it's even got things like if you look at breakers and fuses, instead of having the little blade fuses like you have when you have to replace those, it's got 
uh, resettable 12 volt breakers actually down there. It's a little thing, but again, if you go look at a half million dollar motorhome, it's gonna have stuff like that, right? Let's head upstairs into what may be the most incredible part of this thing. And not that anything else isn't, because it really is, but the bedroom bathroom area of the 39 FBB uh, is absolutely incredible. We've got a king bed. The king bed is standard. You can get it with a queen. Um, one thing that uh, Van Lee has done, they've lowered the bed height. And they did this in response to their clients who again and again were asking for, can you lower the bed? And they did it a couple times and they realized maybe we should do that on all of them. That is the type of uh, company that, that Van Lee is, just like Tiffin. They really respond to what their clients want. They can make changes whenever they want. Um, that's another nice thing um, about uh, just, you know, building as much of it yourself as you can. Look at the dresser on this. This is absolutely incredible. We've got all this really great dresser space. And of course, a little TV up here, which it comes with. I know it's a little thing, but so many of them don't. Um, you know, the air conditioner, I just want to mention this while I'm thinking about it. This is a whisper quiet system where I've got intake or return, excuse me, on this side. And this is where the air comes out. And this is all the way up and down the coach. So all three air conditioner heat pumps are all connected. The there is the returns are here, so they're quiet. You don't hear them. And you have this, this circulation of air up and down the entire vehicle. It's really, really awesome. Um, the doors, even this, I mean, this is the door here. It's nice. You know, it latches, notice, in the open or the closed position, with the idea being if you forgot to latch it and you took off, guess what? The first turn you make, it will latch and it won't be banging around. Um, oh my goodness, this may be the best part. Uh, this bathroom is absolutely incredible. I mean, look at this. We've got side-by-side -side sinks. Look at all the cabinetry in here. It's just beautiful. We've got um, really like almost like a walk-in closet with a, like dedicated shoe storage. I mean, this is like a designer closet, right? Um, this is, and then here, this is where we could put a stacked washer dryer if we wanted to, or we could put a single and still retain a shelf. This is absolutely beautiful. Look at this. I mean, what a great shower. It's huge, beautiful glass doors, a nice place to sit. And uh, last but not least, of course, we have the Tecma electric flush toilet. This thing actually operates more like a residential home toilet than any other commode that we have in the business. Um, so here you have it, everyone. This is the 2021 Van Lee Beacon 39 FBB floor plan. And again, I just want to mention, thanks for watching. If you haven't already done so, subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook to keep up with the news and videos like these. Thank you, everybody.